Record your band, solo act, or podcast in studio or live with Studio 111. 302-222-0666. Man, y'all put y'all hands together, man. Let's clap this thing up, man. Let's, let's get excited. Let's get excited. Let's get excited, baby. It's showtime. Showcase with, my, with your boy Dream, my main man, Just Joe. Yeah. No T is in the building. Week four, Joe, holla at me, man. Talk to me. Man, this is a biblical nature. Right? A thousand dollars. You know anybody that be giving a thousand dollars away on a Thursday? Oh, Just know, man. for laughing it up? That's what I'm talking about, man. Woo. Hey, Joe. Yeah. Man, this has been a great competition, bro. It's more than enough. Oh, man, it's been great. Week and four. Tonight uh, is the Famous Enough Edition. Famous Enough Edition. And we got some people here at the table that is definitely famous enough. I'm going to go around and introduce them. First and foremost, my man, Hurricane, is in the building. What's going on, Hurricane? How you doing, good sir? Uh, always good. Always good, always good. Next to my man, Hurricane, we got Miss Gina. Hello, how yes, are you? Gina's in the building. You know, she's She's looking good. Cleavage got the glitter on the cleavage tonight. So she bringing it. She bringing it. And my man. And none other than a beautiful new sober Josh Ron is in the building. Baby. What's going on, Joshua? At the moment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're beautiful. Not. Look, look. <laughs> Not all of us quit drinking, man. Yeah. I also have you are, around my you, you know, in a, in no a little while, you might be beautiful enough. It's, <laughs> it's like in the casino. You ain't yeah. up or down until you're in the parking lot. Ah, that's, it. Oh, yeah. that's a good point. No, that's if you point. want to bet, if I well, walk out of here Sometimes in the sober. parking lot, you know, you might be yeah. up. No. <laughs> but that's a different show. That's a good point he made. For those who didn't hear Travis say, he got glitter on his cleavage, but we didn't say anything about it. <laughs> well, listen, guys, I'm going to go around. I'm going to start with you, Josh. I'm going to start with you, man. Week four, this is the semifinals. Man, look, this is the real deal. We're, we're eliminating six people tonight, man. Let us, let the people know, man, how's the ride been for you so far, man, and what you got up your sleeve for tonight? It has been a blast. Um, having a lot of fun. Um, last week was a little rough for me and everybody else. Uh, <laughs> me in particular. Uh, being hungover, no AC is a bad, bad uh, combination. <laughs> but no, I'm having a lot of fun. Uh, I'm going to do uh, some new jokes that nobody's heard here tonight. Awesome, man. Uh, I, think, uh, I think they're pretty okay. Okay. Um, and then, yeah, we'll see what happens. I'm going to do my best and uh, try to have fun. Absolutely, man. You can't, if that's, nothing else, I'm going to have fun. If, that's the main thing. Have fun enough. Fun. There's 50 disappointed audience members. I don't want that, but I'll at least have fun. And that's the main thing. Have fun, man. Same question to you, Gina. You know what I mean? Week four, how you feeling? How you feeling going into this semifinal round tonight? I'm feeling pretty good. Hoping I don't get eliminated. Hope I stay and go to the final. All right, all right, all right. All right. What's, what, uh, what has been uh, one of the things that's really stood out for you so far? These, these last couple weeks? It's nice to mingle and meet new people and see all different um, styles of comedy. That's yes. really cool. Awesome, 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 awesome. And I tell you, I've, I personally have enjoyed all you guys so far, man. You've been doing a great job. Hurricane, man. Just Hurricane. Diet Coke, by the way. Oh, no. <laughs> He just got a drink that just came in, for yep. those who don't know. Hurricane, man, you in here, man. Week four, week four, buddy. Week four, man. How you feeling, brother? I'm feeling good. It's a little warm, but the good news is Josh is growing some hydroponic weed in his armpits. So that's <laughs> nice. I'll have a smoke later. Man, that, that, that's, that's all right, you know. Uh, we did have a, we, we had a nice J after week one in the parking lot. And that, and that is joint for those people right. who are reefer, and, who are weed impaired and for those or, uh, ebonic, and for those saying. who don't know next season four we be having a comedy fest in the parking lot we're gonna call it pimping in the parking lot pimping ah, in the parking lot I no like doubt we call it pimping all in the star lot. celebrity roast. what's the attire they need to have for that joke yeah. oh well you know you call up Debbie Hines <laughs> and you get your pimping enough <laughs> pimping in the parking lot baby that's what we'll talk about hurricane man listen. Man, you have been on stage, man, these last four weeks, man. You're really bringing it. Uh, your stage presence has been really, really great. Like, who inspired you, you know? I know you, you, spoke, you spoke about the first week, but, like, you know, as you're going, let me ask you this question. We always talk about who inspired you from a famous, you know, this is famous enough week. So we're not going to, with famous enough week, we're not talking about the people that are famous. We're talking about the people amongst us who we feel are famous enough. So this week, Outside of yourself, of course, out of all the comedians that you've shared the stage with so far in this competition, who has stood out to you and who would you label famous enough? 
Well, you know, I'm gonna <clears throat> I'm gonna take a pass on that because I can't I can't choose between them. They've all been good, you know. I I can say that in the circles that I uh, run in down in Washington, uh, there's some folks that have inspired me a lot. Uh, Tony Woods, number Tony one. Woods. I'm very familiar He's with Tony Woods. Mentor of uh, Dave Chappelle, and uh, I've done shows with him. And one day he complimented me on a joke, and I'm still uh, living off that uh, those fumes for uh, last 20 years. That's awesome. Or that is awesome. Years anyway, but yeah, it's um, I some of the some of the guys I used to do open mics with, and the women have uh, gone to a little bit more fame and fortune. A, a part of non Sherla, Seton Smith, Hampton Yout. You know, look them up. They're all uh, absolutely freaking. Fantastic. Absolutely, absolutely. Same question for you, Jay. So they funny who, enough. Who has, who has been famous enough for you that's not absolute that's not particularly famous? <laughs> that's the question for tonight. Which this is famous enough we not famous for people who we know are famous. We you know, we're homing in on the people like ourselves, you know what I mean? Up and comers who's trying to make it to the next level. So you've been in a four week competition with over twenty six comedians. We're down to eleven. So like who is outside of yourself, of course. You know what I mean? Just, this is just an opportunity to share like who has really inspired you now he, he mentioned some people that wasn't absolutely in the competition hurricane but for you who is it then well um my best friend belinda clear awesome, she's very awesome, yes. uh, inspiring shout out to belinda the queen baby and, she's royal uh, enough i've been taking some coaching lessons from uh, missy hall she lives right down the street from me very familiar with missy yes so that's been you know really you guys awesome. can be sisters y'all kind of favorite <laughs> i know you got to get that i know you get that you got that before right no really you no. guys kind of do favorite you know she has a little bit more blowout but you know yeah you yeah. guys kind of favorite. Yeah. yeah shout out to missy hall yes uh, i'll tell you who i uh, who's uh, caught my eye that uh, uh, is it um delight no not delight the the uh, the tiny young girl yeah uh, that Comedy Creole is what we call it. Yeah. Comedy Creole. Yeah. <laughs> She's one spicy girl. She packs a lot in that 90 pounds. I'll yes, it, that's it. Man. <laughs> Comedy yeah, Creole. Spicy, man. Everything so, she got. Same said. question to you, my man, Joshua, man. Like, who who you got, man, that's famous yeah. enough that's not famous? Uh, as far as people, like, maybe in my circle? Yeah, uh, sure. I, I'm really lucky that uh, a lot of the people that I get to hang out with, for whatever reason, kind of took me under their wing. Uh, Pat House, Mark Riccadonna, mm. Kevin Downey, uh, Troy Allen, Charles McBee, like these just fucking uber talented yeah. guys, man, that just, for whatever reason, just let me hang around. And, yeah. and uh, if you want to get better at chess, play a smarter opponent, right? Yeah. If you wanna, Absolutely right. If you want to get better, be the, the least funniest guy in the room. And yeah. by default, you have to step your game up. Uh, now, so Kevin very Downey, fortunate. Kevin Downey, that's from, from up north? He's from Long Island, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Originally from Detroit. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I had an opportunity to do a show with him. Oh, yeah. yeah he's fucking, he's a Yo, monster. He's a beast. It just, he's a beast on stage. I could do his act like I worked with him a handful of times. Yeah. I'm just a fan. And uh, he's got some jokes that I've literally heard 50 times, and yeah. I'm still fucking crack up. That's, that's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. That's yeah, what it's all about. But listen, guys, listen. I'm, I'm rooting for all of you guys. Thank you guys so much for being part of this competition. I have seen each and every one of you guys grow week to week to week, and it's just an honor to sit back there and watch that. My thing that I would say I'm going to say on the podcast today going into the semifinals is the main thing is what I said last week. Just make sure you do not blow the light. And I mean, I don't mean that literally, Gina, but I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> That's a different show. That's a different show. First of all, it's 2022. Anybody can blow the light now. Okay, so. <laughs> That's your say, Your Honor. I was going to blow the promoter, but I guess I won't do that. <laughs> no, I don't do that either. Blowing bubbles. <laughs> nah, man, but good, good luck to you guys, man. I know you guys do very well. So, 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 so happy to have you guys here, man. Can't wait to hear you guys rock out tonight, man. So, listen, before I sign off, give you guys a shout out. You want to shout out to someone? Any plugs you want to give? I'll start with you, Hurricane. Well, I'll be down in Washington again this weekend doing a couple of shows um, at uh, Club Heaven and Hell and Adams Morgan uh, Saturday and Sunday. And uh, then we'll see what next week brings me. You know, hopefully another trip to Wilmington. Awesome, man. Awesome, awesome. Gina, any yeah. shout outs? Any plugs? Uh, my brother's here tonight, so that should be fun. Yeah, <laughs> shout out to the brother. Yeah. I forgot that he mirrors me and he signed in on the sheet. <laughs> hey, what he's, he's wearing sweet. He's going to do some time tonight. <laughs> he Everybody is. Everybody call his name out. Hey, wait a minute. I don't this guy. <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> Any plugs? Any shout outs for you, Joshua? Uh, I'm going to be in Central PA in a couple of weeks. Uh, that's about it. Um, yeah. Uh, what club? Uh, what club? Uh, uh, church satire. Yeah, that's All a right. great, yeah, that's, that's a awesome. great little club yeah. in Hanover. Jim Bryan. Uh, during my shout-outs, yeah, I fucked yeah, up. Yeah. He, Jim Bryan has been amazing. I, 
I met him uh, the year he opened his club. That, that, that club's like Kevin together. Hart. It's tiny, dark, and funny as hell. <laughs> a thousand percent. <laughs> like but, that, um, <laughs> uh, Joshua Ryan Comedy on Instagram. There it is, man. Well, listen, man. Good, good luck to you guys, man. Once again, man, y'all clap it up, man. Make some noise, man. <laughs> Showtime Showcase, man. It's your boy Dreamer, man. Just throw no tea, man. And we are here at the comedy competition, man. Week four semifinals, and we are out of here. Like our picks? Reach out to me, Rico Maui, at miragephotography.com. That's Mirage Photography with an F. Look good, feel good.